they're recording. Right now, here it is. Okay. Okay. So, uh, I am going to be doing this set up on the floor. Everything I'm going to be doing will be in long sit position. You can do it in the chair. That's totally fine. It's just my apartment is not kind, so I have to do it on the floor. Um, but we started up though, so I do kind of a similar warm up each time I do it. Um, kind of like how Matt has his own warm up each time he does it. So we can just start off with some no money. So I have to stand up nice and tall, and towards the side, down by the side arms back. So we're going to pinch the shoulder blades back together. So let's do this for a couple of reps here. Out. And out. Pinch the blades together. Good. Let's do two more. And out. Good. All right. Next one, we're going to do the reach overs where you reach overhead. As you can see here. Kind of reach up behind and reach as far down your back as you can with both your arms. We're going to stretch all the way through that side here. So we're down front. And then reach over back as far as you can and come down back in front. Let's do this a couple more times. Good. Reach up and over as far as you can. And back one more time. Up and over. And back. Good. All right. Hugs is where. You reach out as wide as you can, and then you give yourself a nice big old hug. So reach out as wide as you can, and a hug, good. Open up the chest, and then get a nice stretch out back behind your scaps. Open up, and hug. Let's do two more of these. Up, and in. Good. One more, out, and in. Good. All right, trunk twist is where you're sitting here. And I'm going to do it long sit, but do that with you, please. We're going to go side to side. Nice and controlled. We're not going and flying around side to side. We really want to use our core and our back to help us turn here. Good. Let's do a couple more each side. Okay, good. We're going to go through all those one more time, but the second time around, we're going to speed it up a little bit. So again, palms up towards the ceiling, elbows down close to your side. And we're going to squeeze back, kind of speed up the pace than what we did the first time around. Good. Right. Two, one, good. All right. Reach over, so same kind of thing. Pick up your face. So reach, back. Oh, reach, oh, reach. Really get that stretch down on the back of the arms. Reach, good, two more, one, and two. Okay, all right, quick hugs. So up, hug, out, hug. Big old open, big old hug. Open, hugs. Get nice and loose. You can just kind of go back and forth between the two. All right, good. All right, last one here, trunk twist. You know, speed it up. So get that core really involved. Make sure that we have our upper back all nice and loose here. All right, a couple more each side. And good. All right, we're going to move into the main part of the workout now. All right, so we have two kind of circuits. I went more of the strengthening route today because I know last time I did it, it was more of a metabolic type route. But we're going this today. So I'm gonna have to play around with my camera angles a little bit. So if you just give me a second. Here, let's go. You're gonna have your band anchored right in front of you. So anchor that band how you can. Right about like shoulder height ish, if you can. If it's a little lower, that's fine too. Okay. So, as I said, I'm going to do all this in the long sit position, but you can do any position that you have. So, I'm just going to run through a quick 
low, low, low down of what all these exercises look like. So the single arm Cuban press, it's going to be arm high. You're going to row back. You're going to punch someone behind you, come out to a Y, come back down, and bring it out in front. So it's going to be back, punch, Y, punch, back, okay? And then the low row is just kind of a staple because it's one of the most similar exercises that we can do compared to what you guys do on the ice. So it's going to be row and kick back. So row back, row back. And then the last one here, we're gonna keep that arm nice and straight, grab a hold of the band however you can. You can do your palms up towards the ceiling and you're just gonna pull that band straight back. Keep the arm nice and straight, elbow nice and straight too. You can have a little bit of a bend, but you don't want a lot of bend. Arm nice and straight and just gonna be pulling it back, okay? Whew. Now that I've done all the talking, and it's getting hot in here, so I can turn the fan back on because I've already explained it. Let's get going, shall we? So we're going to do the single arm. We're going to do whichever, both arms. So it's going to be right arm, left arm, then the rows, then right arm, left arm for horizontal ABD there. All right, everyone ready? Band anchored, fan on. All right, ready? Let's start up with the right arm. So we back, back. Out, down, down, down. And that's going to be one. Okay, so back, up, into a Y, down, and there's two. So back, out, three, back, up, out, four, back, out, five, out, six. Good, we got two more. Up, Y, good, last one on this side. Good, go ahead and switch that band over. We're gonna do it on the left side now. So back, out, into a Y position, come on back down. So boom, 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 boom. It's like we're doing some kind of fancy robot dance, although not nearly as graceful. Out, out. There's four. Out, good, five, out, six, two more, out, seven, and eight, good. All right, we're going to move on to the low row with tricep extension, so go ahead and grab that band in both hands here. So sit up nice and tall, shoulders down, head straight forward, grab your band, Row and back. Row and back. Pinch your shoulder blades together and don't let those shoulders come up to those ears. There's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Good. All right, you're gonna grab the band now with one hand, right or left, doesn't matter, because we gotta do both. So it's gonna be, grab the band. We're gonna actually do, let's do palms down. I think palms down is a little bit more realistic for what you guys do. So palms down, and you're gonna keep that elbow as straight as you can. You're gonna pull it straight back until our arm comes in line with our body. So we don't want to have it fly, fling all the way behind us. So just right out to the side. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Good. Go ahead and switch on over. Palms down. Big key for this one is to bring that shoulder blade back. It's kind of like you're pinching them both together, like we did on the warm up exercise that we did. Let's do 12 on this side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Good. Take a break. We're going to go through those three exercises four more times. 
four, or not four more times, three more times. I can count, I promise. All right, go ahead and grab the band in whichever arm you didn't do the last exercise with. So I'm gonna go back to my right hand, sit up nice and tall, get ourselves ready, and we're gonna up, out, and there's one. Up, out, two, back, out, three, out, four, out, five, out, six, two more, out, seven, last one, out, eight, good, all right, go ahead and grab it with the other hand now, we're going to do eight on the other side, so back, up, one, out, two, out, three, out, four, out. There's five, back, up, out, down, six, two more, out, seven, out, eight. Good, all right, go ahead and grab that band again. We're gonna head right into those low rows with tricep extension. Let's get to it. So we're gonna go here. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Good. All right. Moving on right into that single arm. Go ahead and grab the band with whatever arm you choose. Palm down towards the floor and straight back. Good, try and keep that elbow as straight as you can. It's got a little bit of bend, that's okay too. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Good, go ahead and switch on over. Again, palm down. And we're going to hit 12 on this side. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Good. Take a break. We got two more rounds of that. Two more rounds. Two more rounds. I need water now because it's hot. All right, ready for round three? Let's get it set on up. All right, single arm, pick whichever hand you fancy first. Come on back up. And here's one. Up, out, back, two. Up, out, back, three. Out, four, up. Five, out. There's six, two more. Out. Seven, last one. Out. Eight. Good, all right, go ahead and switch hands. And do eight on the other side now. All right, let's get to it. One. Out, out. Two, back, out. Three, out, four, five, out, six, two more, out, seven, last one, out, eight, good. All right, go ahead and grab onto the band again with both hands. We're gonna go into rows of tricep extension. Okay, one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, last one, twelve. Good. All right, one on one hand again, palm down towards the floor, and elbow nice and straight, and back. 
Exercises. One more round. I'm sweating. Everyone doing okay so far? Good. All right. We're going to start up the last round of these guys here. All right. You guys ready? So fall nice and set up. Pick a hand, whichever hand you like. And let's get to going. There's one, two, three, four, back out, four, out, five, out, six, two more. Seven, eight. All right, go ahead and switch hands. We're gonna do that on the other side. All right, eight on the other side. Let's go. So punch, out, one, out, two, back, out, three, out, four, out, five, out, six, we got two more. Out, seven, out, eight. Whew. Those kill my own rotator cuff. All right, let's go right into the rows. 12 of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Good. All right. Last thing here. Go ahead and grab hold with one hand, palm towards the floor, elbow nice and straight, and out for twelve. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Go ahead and switch hands. Twelve more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Whew. Okay. Done. Circuit one. All right, everyone doing okay so far? Uh, it's a workout for me too. Okay, let's go to circuit two. Oh, I didn't add reps for that one. Hmm. Let's just do that now since we did so well. And that's not what I wanted either. Okay. So for this one, we're gonna set ourselves up 90 degrees to wherever our anchor point is. So I'm going to be doing some fun moving of this camera here in a little bit. But so if my anchor point is here on the table leg, I'm going to be perpendicular to it, 90 degrees to it. So while everybody's getting nice and set up, I want to fix my camera because floor life and the coffee table. So the first one is single arm horizontal. So we're gonna do this time, we're gonna do hand in one hand. It'll be the hand closest to wherever the anchor point is. Your palm is going to be up. You're gonna start out in front. You're gonna bring across. Bring across just like that, okay? And then 
So we're going to do four sets of 12 for that one. So that one will have one more extra than the other two exercises. So the other two exercises are more for the core. So we've done power off presses before. So everybody should know how those work by now. But we're going to do it for 30 seconds. So it's going to be pull it out in front of you, get some nice tension on that band. And we're just going to do some lifts. And we're going to keep tension on that band the whole time, making sure that we don't rotate towards wherever that band is anchored. So we're going to just do nice lifts up and down. And we're going to do that for 30 seconds with 20 seconds off. And so in that 20 second time frame, you're going to set up for that last exercise. So you can either do V-sit holds in your chair. So where you scooch forward on the chair, just kind of lean back, but don't touch the chair, the back of the chair. So that way we're getting our core nice and involved. Or if you're on the floor, you can do V-sit holds where your feet are up off the floor and you're making a V with your body and your legs. Or if you really want to make it some fun, you can do some V-ups where it's just here. You lean back, bring the legs up and knees towards your chest. So again, we're going to do that for 30 seconds, 20 seconds off. So those two will be more for time. And then the single arm horizontal A deduction will be more for reps. Okay. Let me set up the time interval timer here. So that way when we get to the core exercises, I have the timer already. Okay. All right, everyone ready to go? Anybody have any questions? Everyone doing all right? Give me one second. Yeah, take your time. Give me a chance to clear off. Stand going back on. All right. You good, Kevin? Okay. I see the thumbs up, so we're ready to go. All right. So we're gonna do all these facing one direction, all of it facing the other direction, and then we'll flip flop. So that'll be one set. So we'll grab again the arm that's closest to wherever the band is anchored, pull them up towards the ceiling, and do twelve pulling straight across. Okay. So one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Good. All right. Now I got my interval set up. So we're going to get ourselves ready for some cow off press lifts. So again, nice tension on that band. I have the timer going right here. All right. So we're going to get ready to start. And here we go. So tension, we're gonna lift. Keep nice tension on that band the whole time. So you shouldn't let your hands drift towards the anchor point. You're gonna to wanna to keep your core nice and tight. Brace, but breathe. So we're gonna keep going halfway there. Good, keep that core nice and tight. Lifting up. Good, we got five more seconds. Three, two, one, relax, good, 20 seconds off, and then we'll get ready for the V-sit holds or the V-ups, whatever you prefer to do. I'm gonna do a nice hold. These holds are deceivingly hard. All right, we've got about five seconds left here. Ready, two, one, good, hold that V-sit position. Yeah, feet up, only thing touching the floor or touching your chair, should be your, your butt. Good, keep holding. Nice strong core, brace yourself in the front. You're over halfway there. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Good, six, five, four, three, two, one, relax. All right, now we're gonna do all that on the other side. So I need to change my camera set up. Let's see how this works. Oh, that doesn't work half bad. It's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Okay. So we're going to do all this 
on the opposite side now. So go ahead and grab the band with whatever hand is closest to the anchor point. And we're going to come straight across for 12 reps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Good. All right, we're going to get ourselves ready for the paddle off lifts. Whoop. All right, you guys ready? Put some nice tension on that band. Two, one, and go. All right. Up and down. Keep the tension on the band the whole time. Shouldn't let your hands drift towards it. You should be pulling out on the band the whole time. Bracing the core out in front and lifting the arms. Halfway there, guys. Good. Keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. And relax. 20 seconds break. And then we're going to get ready for another round of V-sit holds or V-ups or whatever you're feeling. I like doing the isometric ones, but that's just a personal thing. All right. Ready? Five, four, three. Get it ready. One. And we're going to hold the base it and hold it for 30 seconds. Keep that core nice and tight. Keep the back up off the floor, feet up if you want. If you want to make it more challenging, you can lean yourself back more. If you want to make it less challenging, you can pull your feet up more, wherever you feel. Let's see. Oh, five, four, three, two, one and good. All right, so that is one set. We're gonna flip back over and face the other side. Back and forth dance. All right, give everybody a little bit of time to set up. Take a break. Grab some water if you need it. All righty. Okay. Everyone ready to go for round two? All right, let's get it going. So again, grab palm facing the ceiling. Grab one from the band, a little bit of tension. We're gonna go for 12 across the body. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Good. All right. Get ready for those palo flips. Put some tension on that band. All right. I'm gonna start in four, three, two, one, go. All right. Should be turning out against the band. Don't let it pull you in. Should be giving you some resistance the whole time. Gonna keep going. Got halfway there. Good. Should feel that side of the core working pretty good here. Maybe get your arms involved. Three, two, one, and good. 20 seconds off. And then we're gonna go right into the V sits. So again, if you're in a chair, you just scoot yourself up towards the edge of the seat. So that way your back isn't up against the backrest. That way you can get some angle there going. Ready? Three, two, one, and reset. Again, you really want to focus on keeping that core muscles nice and tight, pulling your ribs down to really feel it right in the front of that core. Again, if you want to make it harder, you can let yourself go out a little more straight. 10 seconds left. Good. Keep holding. Five, four, three, two, one, and good. All right. I'm going to flip to the other side now. Flip and do the other side. Okay. Give a second flip. Get yourself situated. Get some more water. 
All right. Okay, whenever you guys are ready, go ahead and grab that band with the arm closest to the band. Again, palm up. Put some tension on the band. If you want to make it more difficult, start with more tension on the band. Straight down front, we're going to go across body. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Good. Keep that band in hand. We're going to get ready for paddle off presses. Good. Three, two, one, go. Going up and down. You want to make it more difficult, you can increase the tension on the band, just like we did for the first exercise. Good. Make sure you're not turning in. Halfway there, guys. Really bracing with that core. Get the core ready for some slide hockey. Good. Five, four, three, two, one. Good, we got 20 seconds of break and then we'll go right into the V-sit hold. All right, 10 more seconds here. All right, ready? Five, four, three, two, one, and hold. Good, we're holding for 30 seconds here. Good, keep going again. Brace that core nice and tight. I feel this in my low back. That's interesting. But keep the core nice and tight. Feet up off the floor if you can. If not, just make sure that back isn't touching the backrest. Again, five, four, three, two, one, and done. All right, we're gonna switch back over to the other side. Computer dance. Okay. Take a break, get some water, and go through that, at least the core and all that, to one more time. But we'll do, we'll, how about we do this so that way we're not flipping as much? How about we do two sets on one arm of the horizontal stuff so that way we're not flipping back and forth again? Try to make it a little easier as far as positioning goes. Move this down just a second. Okay. All right. You guys ready? Let's get this show on the road. So, again, palm up. Put some tension on that band. All right. We're going to go 12 across. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12. Good. We're going to take a little bit of a break and then we're going to do 12 more on that same arm so that way we're hitting our four sets without having to flip around for another time. So we're going to do that same exercise again for 12 more reps. Ready? Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Good. All right. You guys ready for power off lifts? I'm going to start them up here in four, three, two, one. Go. Pull them nice and tight. Resisting that rotation. Bring the arms up and down. Try and keep them in a nice straight line with the midline, center line of your body. Halfway there. Good. Up and down. Keep going. Try not to let those shoulders come up by the ears. Three, two, one, and relax. 20 seconds until we do a V-sit hold here. Okay. I am sweaty. This is a good workout for me too. All right, yeah. Five more seconds till we get hit this V up. Two, one, and go. So a nice core hold here. Good, keep it up. 
I'm gonna make it a little more challenging and let my feet out a little bit more. Halfway there. Okay, keep it up. 10 seconds left, guys. Keep holding. Five, four, three, two, one, and relax. Okay. We're gonna flip around one last time here. This will be the last kind of go through we do of this little circuit. And then that'll be the workout. All right. Everyone's flipped. Face the other direction. Take a sip of water. And ready for it. Again, we're gonna do two sets of this. Bring the arm across on this side too. So that way we have our four sets. Let's go ahead and grab your band. Palm up towards the ceiling. And go ahead and bring it across for 12. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Good, take a break. We're gonna do one more set of 12 here. Make sure that when you're doing that, your shoulder stays nice and down. You don't want it creeping up towards your ear. Don't want to be looking like a turtle. All right, ready to hit the last 12 of these? Last 12. Go ahead, let's start up. In two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Good, all right. Guys, gonna get ready for your pal off presses. Go ahead and grab one of that band and start up in three, two, one, and go. So up and down. Good, keep it going. Keep those arms right in the center. Don't let them drift towards wherever the band is anchored. Good, halfway there. Gonna keep the core nice and tight. And up and down. We got five, four, three, two, one, and relax. All right, 20 seconds of break, and then we got our last exercise of this workout. One more V sit. Yeah. All right, almost there. We're going to get it starting up, ready to go in five, four, three, two, one and go. This is the last exercise of the night, guys. Feel that core nice and tight. Hold yourself up. Keep it up. Make sure to breathe while you're doing this too. Halfway there. Always breathe during exercises. Keep it up, guys. I'm shaking. Five, four, three, two. One and done. All right. That was the workout. That was a good workout. I don't know about you guys, but I'm feeling that one pretty good in my shoulders. Whew. All right. I'm going to stop the screen. <laughs>